Well, they grade one races keep coming thick and fast, but this is the last one for today. Anyway, two more five foot on grade one. Milling Chase, Bernie Spann, David Robertson, Dave's Chance, David Hooley, Damani Steele, Darren Thompson, El Centro rated Vinnie Gerard, Folk Etymology and Guard Francais. Or Leon van Rensburg, Gariba, Martin Lidham, Rippling Road, John Morgan, Templar Knight, Daniel French, the best is yet to come, and the fault line, Joshua Sutherland, Dame Rapunzel, Martin Lidham, Magic Stars, David Hooney, Paperweight Walker, David Robertson, Pot of Cash, Craig Beckwith, and San Pedro owner, Vinny Gerrard. 16 of them in this, no two mile grade one this week, away and racing, so maybe one or two of these going a little bit further than they would like. Two mile four furlongs a lot sharper than the two mile five of the Ryanair last week as well. So there could be a few who were going not quite as far as they'd like. So it could be an interesting race. And will be made even more interesting if Rippling Road sets a stiff pace, which it looks like it's going to do at the moment. So Rippling Road in the lead. Coming to the first all 14 and they're not hanging about. They are going more the pace of a two mile race than a two and a half. Uh, this is a fast track as well. Uh, Ripley Road is well clear. I think one or two of these might pay for this pace later on. They pay in play into the hands of the horses who can go a bit further. Two miles will struggle, I think, as they get over the third. And they're all safely over the third with Rippling Road clear. El Centro rated his second. Dame Rapunzel is next. San Pedro Werner. He's after that one, then Templar Knight with Magic Stars, Pot of Cash, the fault line. After that, looking towards the back, Dave's Chance and Folk Etymology are the back two as they took the fourth. And Rippling Road, here to win a race, I think, when he's clear at the moment. On the Vinnie Gerard PNL Centro rated in San Pedro, and a Dame Rapunzel is next. That's a bit of a 18 furlong or so. Might be a bit on the sh sh might be a bit too far for her today. And it's Rippling Road in the lead. San Pedro in a second. El Centro Rage, then Templar Knight. And at the fault line. Dame Rapunzel is next. And then Damani Steel. Pot of Cash is next. And the leader took that one clear. The best is yet to come is now the back mark. I don't see too many Josh horses struggling to go to pace. But it's Rippling Road. Who's clear in front. Not quite so far now. As they come up past the stands and the enclosures this will be the final fence on the next oh there's a fall there and guard force is gone and the first one to depart is Leon van Rensburg's guard force as they head out then on their second circuit it's rippling road is clear from San Pedro and El Centro rated then the fault line and Templar Knight then Gariba then Dave's Chance and Damani Steel and Potter Cash Bernie Span and Dame Rapunzel and then Folk Etymology and Magic Stars with Paperweight Walker White on the track and the best is yet to come is a couple of lengths of drift but he's going to try and go up the inside rippling road still clear by about three lengths to San Pedro and the fault line El Centro rated in Templar Knight, then Gariba getting a bit closer. And Dave's Chance and Damani Steel as they complete this long run to the next. And the leader really jumped that way. Oh, there's another one down there. Pot of Cash has gone this time. So Pot of Cash falls there for Craig Beckwith, but Rippling Road continues to lead. El Centro rated his second. The fault line is next as they get over that one. Really good jump there by El Centro rated. Seen it jump into the lead. But immediately on the inside, Rippling Road fights back and they're heading down towards this next one. And a bad mistake there by El Centro rated has seen it surrender the lead again to Rippling Road. On this turn, Rippling Road's now too clear again from El Centro rated in second. Then San Pedro Werner. Dave's chance is starting to run on. Then comes the best is yet to come creeping through from the back. The leader was nearly down Rippling Road. And El Centro rated's gone back on again. The best is yet to come is next. Dame Rapunzel trying again to get into it on the inside. There's plenty in with chances. It's El Centro rated. And Rippling Road with three to jump from on the inside. Dame Rapunzel. Then Templar Knight in the fault line. The best is yet to come is after that one. This is a third last. Really good jump by our Centro rated. In second, Templar Knight is now running on. Then comes Rippling Road. Dame Rapunzel moves into fourth as they head down towards the final two. It's El Centro rated. Two lengths clear of Templar Knight in second. Over the second, that's the leader. Hits it hard. Templar Knight jumps it better in second. Dame Rapunzel third. Then folk etymology in the fault line. They're racing down towards the final fence and it's Templar Knight on the near side. El Centro rated on the far side. They come into this final 
offence now it's all going to come down to the jump I think as they come into it they're matching strides over it they go better jump by El Centro rated Tempra Knight he's trying to fight back but it's El Centro rated that takes it Tempra Knight is singing Damani still running on to be third in the fault line the message yet to come Dave's chance focus Imology and all the way back to Gariba he didn't stay the trip and Vinnie Gerard takes it El Centro rated did his best to lose that hitting a few fences really hard but managed to stay on his feet and won it quite nicely El Centro rated for Vinnie Gerard the winner Templar Knight Daniel French second Damani Steele Darren Thompson third and Joshua Sutherland was fourth and fifth with the fault line and the best is yet to come